Buju, Kinamagi and Nene Ireland Indigenous Casa, and welcome to today's reading Tier 2 Intervention. Today's episode, The Mighty Saguaro Cactus, Day 2. Today's focus is on subject-verb agreement. And a lot of times this is going to be based on how it sounds. They're going to give you in this example some two choices. And then you're going to go with the one that's based on the verb. A singular verb tends to end in with an S and the verb. So let me get the annotation tool here. The mighty saguaro stores water in its arms. If I said the, the saguaro store water in its tr arms and trunk, you would understand it, but it doesn't sound quite right. Singular verbs tend to end in S. Many bird or birds make their nests in saguaros. Many bird? Many is plural, so, but I'm still, because they're grouped together, I'm going to go with birds. It sounds better that way as well. And that's the number one tool. The baby birds hide or hides. Now birds, we have an S here. So we're going to go hide from predators. Number four, she feel or feels it is great to see a baby owl. She is singular, so it should end in S. Let's listen to it. She feels it is a treat to see a baby owl. Sounds much more smooth than she feel it is a treat. And number five, the last one we'll do together. They stand or stand silently through the day and night. And this one, they is plural. So it'll be stand without the S. They stand silently through the day and night. So if you're talking a singular subject, it'll generally end in S. If it's a plural subject, it's going to not end in S. But you do have to pay attention to what, when we see many, in this case, they put it all together. Well, really the birds would be in the subject, many birds. And then if it had been one, one bird makes their nest, or it would fit there. So I kind of messing with you a little bit because everyone else was the verb. Okay, so remember to take another time to read the Mighty Saguaro Cactus. You will have a Google form to finish these five and we'll see you in our next class session. If you have any questions, reach out to me at myrlandatsagchipschool.net. I'm a P.